Hello everybody, this is Armand Ninja, and I'm going to be teaching you guys how to make a one-name Google Plus YouTube account. So, most of you guys, if you're just joining YouTube, wanting to make amazing content for the community, are coming up with this problem. And the problem is called, you're joining and your name is actually being displayed. For instance, if your name is Lizzie McGuire, your name is actually going to be Lizzie McGuire, not The Cougar Gaming, okay? So, the way you're going to solve this is actually pretty intricate and detailed as far as I'm concerned this is the only way I haven't found other ways on YouTube there might be some out there but I just can't find them so I'm here to go and uh, give you guys a clear cut easy way to do this so the first thing you want to do is you want to make your name on a Google account you want to make a Gmail and for your Gmail you want to make it something you know this is just your Gmail when you sign into it this is what you're going to be getting emails from YouTube and all those things from so let's say I want to do um, the amazing cannonball at gmail.com okay the password um, it can be whatever you want um, make sure that it's confirmed on both ones in the same your birth date, even if you are really young, I would recommend that you completely bullcrap it and go old. For instance, if you're not over 18, you won't be able to view over 18 content, and I don't think any of us want that. For your current email address, you don't need to fill that out, and you don't need to fill out a mobile phone either. For this one, you just need to type in what's here. You should be good at this one if you're not a robot, apparently. So, I mean, I'm pretty sure I should be capable of doing this. So finish that out and then agree to the Google Terms and Services policies and you will be prompted to verify your account. How should we? Whoa, 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 whoa. So hold on. This didn't happen before. Um, I'm going to just skip this part. Okay, guys. So if this did happen for you, you'll put in your phone number. If you don't have a phone number, you probably shouldn't be doing YouTube. But you'll put in your phone number for that and then they'll send you a text message of a verification code and once you get the verification code you'll need to enter that and click continue this didn't happen for me last time I tried to make this but then you're gonna prompt it to be here and you want to click next step then you want to click continue to Gmail and then once you're continuing to your Gmail you should actually be good to go and logged into your Gmail and now that you've done this you can create your YouTube account. So, this is all stuff that you should probably know by now. I mean, most of you by now are not that dumb that you don't know how to create a Google account. It's it's pretty self-explanatory, but there you go. If you didn't already, this is how you do it. So, next, you want to go to YouTube and you want to click sign in on the top right. So, do that and then enter your password. It should already come up with a username. And then once you enter that, sign in. Um, this one, just click no thanks. I wouldn't recommend doing it. It's basically security stuff. So there you go. As you can see, you now have your pesky little Tom McBurger here. You don't want that. So most people's problem is that they'll go to the YouTube settings and they'll spend hours here. And this was my problem too. I spent five hours victim looking for things in loopholes. Whereas the secret is you need to go to settings on your Google Plus page. So once you're at your settings, you'll have something that looks like this. Now, if you were making your account prior to the merge, there is a much easier way to do this. Um, rather than going to your Google Plus page, there's actually an option in the YouTube settings that makes it much easier for you. That's what I did for my channel, and that's what you should do for your channel. But, say you made it just like now, like I did, you are going to have a steaming pile of crap of a username. So, basically what you need to do is you need to delete your profile and remove related Google Plus features. Click the top bullet, and then click the required box. Now, click Removed Selected Services. This should be mandatory for everyone. There should be no changes. So once you've done that, you'll get this prompt. You've successfully deleted Google Plus and associated content. I'm sorry about this. I'm sorry about it. I'm, I have Steam open, okay? I'm sorry. Anyways, you're going to want to go to YouTube after this. And as you can see, once I drew the drop down, there's no more Google Plus features on the side. That's because you've deleted that portion of your account. You want to click Settings after this. You're going to be taking to your Settings page, but now, if you look, it's different. You're going to have a prompt that says Create a Channel. You want to click that, okay? Once you click that, you're going to get this pop down, right? So what you're probably thinking right now is, oh my god, he's totally trolling us. It's just going to be an ongoing loop, but it's not. 
If you look in the fine print, you're going to see to use a business or other name, click here. So you want to click there. Once you've done that, you can name your channel. For instance, let's say I want to name it the Water Ball of Jesus. Do that. Click whatever applies to you. If you're doing gaming, I would recommend doing arts, entertainment, or sport, or other. And your content is appropriate for any Google Plus user. Don't change that. Then click I agree to the page terms. Click done. Once you have done that, you'll be taken back to YouTube and you will have a one letter name. So at this point, you are done. Your channel is now officially successfully a non Google Plus stupid thing. And it's actually a correct YouTube channel name. So if you go to switch account, it is still actually there. But if you, for instance, click on it, you'll be prompted, choose which one you want. Just click the water ball of Jesus or whatever you want your channel name to be. And this will pop up 100% of the time. You go to YouTube, everything's good. And you have rid yourself of Google+. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. If you found it informative and helpful, please leave it a rating and subscribe for Novity and be an active sub to me. So guys, be sure to like, favorite, and subscribe for Novity. Also share to Facebook and Twitter. And if you really want to help me out, do them both together. So, that's all I'm going to say for you guys today. Ninja, out. <laughs>